Today, I'm going to tell the story of star spirits and good wishes. Far, far away beyond the sky, way above the clouds. It's been said that there's a haven where the stars live. In the sanctuary of Star Haven, there rests a fabled treasure called the Star Rod, which has the power to grant all wishes. Using this wondrous Star Rod, the seven revered star spirits watched over our peaceful world. Carefully. Very carefully. And then... Oh dear, what the? Who stuck that weird thing into this story? Ha <laughs> ha yeah, I did. ha <laughs> So I can at long last beat my arch enemy Mario? I'll take this star rod. Do it, Kami Koopa. No, you mustn't do that. Yeah, now let's try using it. Stop it! Cut it out, Bowser! You're changing the story! Gwahaha! <laughs> we did it! That was a piece of cake! Gwahaha! <laughs> Now Star Kids may rise to the haven to deliver people's wishes, but those wishes will not come true. Whatever can they do? And welcome to my new Let's Play of Paper Mario. This is one of my favorite titles for the N64, and the predecessor to one of my favorite games of all time. In fact, I actually did a full Let's Play, um, towards the beginning of my channel, but it was so early on, I've been wanting to revisit it for a while and do a better job with it. So with that being said, let's get started. Mail call! Hey Mario, we got a letter from Princess Peach. I'll read it to you, okay? Alright, let's see. I'm throwing a party at my castle today. Mario and Luigi, I would be honored if you both could attend. Many guests from distant towns are hoping to meet you. There will be, a, be tasty sweets and all kinds of entertainment. I hope to see you here soon. Sincerely, Peach. What a magnificent castle! I never get used to this place. Looks like a lot of guests are already here. And now, we're in control of the game. So we can go around and talk to people. Welcome to Peach's Castle! Mario, you're looking well. Please enjoy the party, okay? Wow, I've never seen so many guests from different parts of the world in one place. I'll bet you could hear some stories about places you've never been to, huh? Such as from this penguin up here. Wow, this castle is absolutely breathtaking, don't you think? I wish I could stay here at Peach's castle forever. Alright, so now that we are inside the castle, which is uh, loosely based on Super Mario 64's version, we can go find Princess Peach. Uh, 
I come from a desert town called Dry Dry Outpost. This castle's really lovely, isn't it? Truly gorgeous, so cool and comfortable. I even got a chance to talk to the beautiful Princess Peach. What an honor. When I return to Dry Dry Outpost, I'm going to tell everyone about it. I'm a nomad mouse, and I come from Dry Dry Desert. Everyone I've met in this town seems incredibly nice. I think I'll make this place my home away from home. We have a little bit of a secret over here, if I'm not mistaken. This is Princess Peach's room, but I'm afraid she isn't in here at the moment. Huh? Oh no, absolutely not. I don't think it's very polite to go into her room without asking her first, Mario. I said no, and that means no. You are simply not allowed to go in there. I said no, and that means no. <laughs> You're simply not allowed to go in there. Um... Boy, you're persistent. I guess I have no choice. Hurry up in there, though, and don't touch anything. So yeah, a little bit of a secret uh, part of this castle tour. We can actually enter Princess Peach's room. A framed photo of Mario. Um, quite a fluffy bed. It looks like this bed was designed for sweet dreams. These are cosmetics. Mario looks fine without them. Her dresses are beautiful, but they all look the same. They must be her favorite style of dress. What a big fireplace, and what a cozy fire. And with that little bit of sightseeing out of the way, how was it? To tell you the truth, I've never seen the inside of her room. I come from Koopa Village, which is just down the road from here. Oh, I just had the honor of talking with Princess Peach. What a wonderful lady she is. I'm here on behalf of lovely Shiver City. I'm the mayor there, you know. Uh, my goodness, look at the time. I have to go shopping for souvenirs with Frost Tea. Alright, so there's some more rooms. It doesn't seem to open. So, um, we can head up to the next floor. I- I'm just a trainee, sir. So many guests. My heart's been beating like a bass drum ever since this morning. Thump, 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 thump. Alright, new area of the castle, which is a great time to show off. We can spin! By pushing, uh, Z, um, you can spin. Uh, but it has a little bit of end lag, so the best way to spin is to jump at the end, uh, so you can keep your momentum uh, without slowing down, like so. Alright, Princess Peach should just be down this hallway. Oh, Mario, you came to the party to see me? You're so sweet, thank you. I was just resting a bit. It gets tiring greeting all those guests out there. Nobody will bother us here. Shall we relax and chat? Just the two of us? It was a lovely day today, so I'm sure it's comfortable out there on the balcony right now. Would you accompany me, Mario? Oh, are you alright, Mario? What in the world was that? Oh my, look, Mario. It's still daytime, isn't it? But I can see stars outside. Wahahaha! <laughs> Long time no see, Princess Peach. Bowser, but this can't be. It was you who made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? Whatever did you do? Wahahaha! <laughs> Yeah, that was me. I've lifted your castle up into the sky. It's sitting on my castle now. Weren't expecting that, huh? Ah, this castle's under my control now, my dear. Now you will obey me. Huh? What? It's Mario. What a shock. Ha, ah, not really. I expected you to turn up right on cue. You're just as annoying as ever. Unfortunately for you, there's nothing you can do this time. Haven't you learned your lesson by now, Bowser? You can never defeat Mario. Why don't you give up already? True, true. I have had my problems in the past, but this time is different. This time, I'm gonna win. Okay, tough guy, let's go. 
Mario, you can do it! So, we have our first battle. We cannot use strategies or items, so we can only jump at the moment. So, we can't even guard, as far as I can tell. Or I just got the timing really off. Um, so... We just kind of have to chip away at his health, and hope uh, nothing horrible happens in the meantime, I suppose. Um, we can only do simple jumps. Good old Mario, always fighting. You're a thorn in my side, but today your pathetic little attacks won't beat me. Take a look at this. Look at what I stole from Starhaven. It's the Star Rod. This fine piece of work has the power to grant any wish in the whole wide world. And when I use the Star Rod to increase my strength, even you can't beat me, Mario. Wow! <laughs> How do you like that, Mario? Well, this is a problem. We are in danger, which means you have five health or below, and now we can't do any damage. Wahahaha, <laughs> Is that all you've got? How sad! You best take some vitamins, cause that didn't hurt at all. Now we're down to two HP. Um, this isn't looking good. Yep, just as expected. Mario's no match for the new me. It's not even worth my time to toy with you anymore, Mario. It's time to end this. Here we go, Mario. Good night. Oh no, Mario, get up. Yes, oh yeah, I did it. Finally did it. I beat my old rival Mario, yes. Congratulations on your victory, your viciousness. That's why you're the king. As long as I have the star rod, everything I wish will come true. No one can stop me now. Well, well, well. I guess I might as well get rid of Mario. He's no good to anyone now, that's for sure. Oh no, Mario! Prologue, a plea from the stars. Oh, thank heavens. He's been gravely injured, but I think he'll recover. But Bowser's the Star Rod, and now he's mightier than Mario. It's hopeless. All is lost. Everybody, just calm down. As long as we keep it together, there's always hope. Now. Our fates are in Mario's hands. We must try to revive him. Gather around, everyone. Send Mario your power. Phew, that's it. That's all we can do right now. Mario, please get up. Please. It really sounded like something fell somewhere around here. Oh, who could that be? This red shirt, this hat, and this mustache. You know, this really looks like the one and only Mario. It couldn't be, could it? The real Mario? Hey, hey, wake up, come on. Up and at him. Oh no, he won't wake up. Oh, oh, what am I gonna do? Dad, Koopa, Goombario.
Mario, can you hear me, Mario? I'm Eldstar, a star spirit. I have something very important to tell you. It concerns the princess and all of the Mushroom Kingdom. But sadly, I haven't the strength to talk to you here. Mario, I need to have you come to Shooting Star Summit. Please, Mario, we star spirits will be waiting for you at the summit. Oh, Mario! I'm so happy to see you awake. You haven't opened your eyes for days and days. Everyone's been worried sick. This place? Uh, this is Goomba Village. It's a tiny village that's just west of Toad Town. The only residents are me and a single family of Goombas. The Goombas and the family are the, just the nicest folks you'll ever meet. Uh, they're the ones who found you unconscious in the forest and carried you here to get better. Huh? A star with a mustache? You're saying a star told you to go to the Shooting Star Summit? No, I saw nothing like that, and I sure didn't see anyone come in or out of this house. I wonder, Mario, maybe you just had a dream. Although, maybe not. It could have been some sort of message from a star spirit. They live in Star Haven. Shooting Star Summit is the nearest place to Star Haven, so that would make sense. Who knows? In any case, I'm glad to see you've recovered. I know the Goombas would be happy if you paid them a visit. And here we are in Goomba Village. Hey Mario, I'm Goombario. I'm your biggest fan. You don't know what this means for me to meet you, seriously. Mario, you look better. I'm so glad. I was really worried about you because you were lying there in the forest and you didn't open your eyes at all the whole time. Oh, land's sake, Mario. So nice to meet you, my. I'm so glad you woke up. I can't tell you how worried I was when you were just lying there asleep for so long. And here is, uh, something really important. This is a save block, so when you're ready to quit, um, hit this block to save your game progress. When the game is over, your status will return, uh, to what it was the last time you saved, and you can continue to play. When you find this block along the way, remember to hit it to save. Do you want to save? Yes, we do. Sa save completed. And with that, uh, next time we will try to get to uh, Shooting Star Summit. So, thank you for watching, and I hope you'll join me next time for more Paper Mario.